Welcome back, Josie Sports Nation fans. If you're here for the first time, uh, do me a favor, hit that like button. Also, hit that subscribe and hit that notification bell. Well, we have sad news uh, with uh, one of the NBA women's all-stars, Brittany Griner. She was arrested in Russia on drug charges. Now, this must have happened uh, maybe a month ago, and I think people were doing research, and they realized that uh, Brittany Griner... Rainer, um, she wasn't really active on social media since uh, February 5th. So the WNBA All-Star and two-time Olympic champion Brittany Griner faces five to ten years in Russia prison after she was arrested on drug smuggling charges when she was found with vape cartridge in her carry-on luggage at a Moscow airport, according to Russian news sources her team the uh, Phil the Phoenix Mercury confirmed a situation in Russia without mentioning specifics we are aware of and are closely monitoring the situation with Brittany Griner in Russia the team said in a statement we remain in constant contact with her family her representation the WNBA and NBA we love and support Brittany and at this time, our main concern is her safety, physical and mental health, and her safe return home. So, um, basically, she was arrested a couple weeks ago. and She's been detained for a couple weeks. And one of our USA uh, teammates um, basically tweeted out and said that she was detained three weeks ago. Now, a drug a sniffling dog indicated nar narcotics in luggage and when the bag was x-rayed so-called vapes were discovered with a specific odor according to Interfax. Now the expert found that there was liquid product drug cannabis oil. See this is just something that people need to realize we we always think it's cute to go see the world but you got to understand these are different countries and they're run differently than we are. Right now, it's a very scary thing in Russia because they're invading Ukraine at this point. And this may become political. We, ne we don't know. Um, I know that Americans have Russian um, people that's locked up as well. So it's kind of a thing where, you know, if the government do step in, well, we'll see. If the government do step in, you'll say, hey, you know, they have to really bargain with her. But... This happens before. This happened with um, Lajello Ball when he was in China and he committed a crime. I believe he stole something from over there. And you don't know what they do with their prisoners. You know, people were scared for his life, but he ended up getting out. And I remember Trump uh, came in and tried to talk to their government to let him loose. And that just goes to show you, like I said, when you go to these other countries, you have to go by their rules. You can't go by your rules because you know they will lock you up you know you go to China people have been went to jail and all of a sudden they end up dead you know so it's very scary definitely pray for Brittany and her family I hope she come out on top and I know that she plays for Russia um, basketball team you know because she can't make enough money playing for the WNBA so a lot of women play overseas and they play here in the summer but uh, tell me what you think about this situation with Brittany Griner. Uh, leave a comment below, and I'll see you on the next video.